Yo. All right. Uh, let me get my final thoughts at the moment right now. After just beating the game. Rise on the room. It wasn't. It wasn't that bad, man. I don't know how I got so many like terrible reviews. I do see like the gameplay, like the fighting style was a little repetitive, and like the executions they need to make, they need to make new ones involve the environment more. I had a couple environment kills, but they should have more of that just to flare it up and to mix it up a little bit. And the enemies, there was a couple bosses, maybe like I don't know, maybe like three bosses overall. And someone recycled like Boudicca and stuff like that. But the story though, I love the story. I love the gore. I'm a big fan of the Spartacus TV show and you know that's off the air now. And this this was an awesome treat right here. Uh no regrets on the purchase. I'm definitely gonna be checking out the multiplayer and see what that's all about. And that will basically be the deciding factor whether I keep the game or not because after you know the story, after you play it through, there's really no replay value because the combat system is basically going to be the same and there's no additional reward. I still got like, I think a half a million experience points to, to use. So I, I beat the game half ass. I'm not even leveled up to my max. If I use those points, the game would probably be easy as hell. So yeah, there, there is like no replay value for the, uh, the main story, line, main campaign. But multiplayer is next, and I'm looking forward to it. But yo, uh, if you've been watching with me up to this point, uh, thank you. Uh, this is Trey. Too close to hold on Xbox Live. Games over ENT on the YouTube. Uh, stay tuned for more uh, Rise Center Rome action. I may put like a highlight reel out there very soon. But yep, that's it for my gameplay. I uh, hope you enjoyed it. See ya.